Guys, Bob Risky told the court that he is a man. <laughs> Like I shook. I was so surprised. Just hear from the horse's mouth, guys. Mommy of Lagos admitted to be a man. Ah, the thing choke. Just hear from his mouth. Idris Okudaya, Bob Risky. Now he's been sentenced to six months in prison. Perhaps one question that's been on the lips of people is which uh, you know, cell he would be in. Is it the female cell or the male cell? What more can you tell us about this matter? Well, it's going to be rather difficult to ascertain as now, as at now where he will be. But one interesting scene played out in court today, Bosse, before Justice Awogoro of the Federal High Court, uh, where I am, where I am. Um, as soon as he came in, the judge asked for his gender, and he said, "I am a man." And this is unlike the position that Bob Brisky had been um, you know, propagating online. We know how prominent he is online. We, we know how loud he has been uh, with the sisterhood um, code that he has been identifying with and being open about his transitioning from a man to a woman. Of course, we also know that the name on the chat sheet is reading Idris Okunoye, Idris Olarewaji Okunoye, male in brackets, and um, as such, even though he came in dress today, just like the last John date, in uh, a long uh, jalamia, so to speak, in a long black robe, and he had a veil on. At the last John date, the judge also asked him to remove the veil that he had on uh, covering his face. And, and he, of course, um, um, you know, obliged, you know, of course, obeyed uh, the order. But today was also a very interesting thing, like I said earlier, earlier on, where he identified as being a man. While he was in the ESC custody, where he was brought from uh, to hear his sentencing today, we understand that he had been in a lone cell, neither a male or a female cell, but he had been kept in a lone cell, he alone, so to speak. And we also understand that at the point, of course, his beds were already growing, although that has not been confirmed uh, by the ESC operatives, but uh, uh, we, we, we heard that in, in, in the grapevine, so to speak. So, where he's heading, I don't know if the correctional facility has the luxury of a lone cell, unlike what's obtained uh, while he was in ES custody. But presently, he's in the holding cell within the court premises, the Federal High Court premises, because there are still some other matters ongoing here uh, in Ikoi. So when they are all done, because now he has been transferred to the Ikoi Correctional uh, Center, where he is expected to serve out uh, his... Um, his um, sentencing. So, but he has been kept with some other inmates at the holding cell of the Federal High Court. Going, I was telling.